Okay, so now a wacky thing that you could do with Z spheres and topology tools in the regards to making of hair, vines, and really thin tube like things. Okay, so here we go. Uh, let's say, well, we need a tool, right? And I like that demo head because these takes very little time whatsoever. So I'm going to load that de demo head and I'm going to just, uh, let's see here go into a z-sphere okay okay rigging select mesh select the demo head topology edit topology okay now don't click anything just yet we need to get our bearings so I'm going to activate symmetry and go to Z radio count and turn my radio count rather high okay just click on the demo head Okay, that is not the right way, so let's find the right one. It should be Y, and Y is correct. Okay, undo. Okay, here's the key. Don't shift and click. Just click. Okay, good. Okay, now what I need to do, this is my Z-sphere I made right here. Okay, that was my one where I clicked at. Okay, so I'm going to click again. Okay, click again and again and maybe I want to put some down here on his shoulders like that I can also go to the move tool and move these straighten them out if I wanted to okay I can take off symmetry and rotate like I say I rotate some of these back like this rotate this one back some and you get the idea you can just rotate these around and style the hair you can also move them by cl click on the move and moving them back like this okay all right you got the idea not gonna style the hair uh, okay now how do you convert this to hair well that's easy okay hit a on the keyboard Convert to main. Okay. Unclick edit topology. Delete mesh. And you have this. Okay. Go to draw. Let's get rid of the center. And uh, these aren't polygons yet. So what we need to do is go up here. Hit A. And you get this real fine spray of polygons make this a poly mesh next very important you go to the move tool and move this up and then down why it will crash if you do not okay now you can go to the deformation tablet palette not tablet hmm. and then go inflate voila hair okay and now this hair can be actually just kind of moved around it all depends how much effort you put into the original like if, if you sat here and styled it out using the original topology it would work out good okay let's uh, take the demo head and let's go to subtools append that hair and then I can just kind of go in to this one and I can just click and drag it out. Now to get thicker hair, what you have to do is duplicate the topology tool over and over again. Uh, the This one right here, over and over again, until you get really thick locks of hair. Or you can take the original radial count and turn it up to something like, say, oh, 100, and you'll get all kinds of crazy hair at once. All right, so enjoy. And uh, you can actually make vines like this, too. Uh, just leave off the radial count. All right. Have a good one. Until next lesson.